Today we are going to learn a theorem of binary tree where we are going to prove that maximum number of nodes at level i of a binary tree is 2 to the power i where i is greater than or equal to 0. Now first let me tell you what the theorem wants to prove. This is root of a binary tree. This is a binary tree. A single node is binary tree by itself. And if this is a single node, then this is the root of the binary tree. Correct? Now, root of the binary tree is always considered to be at level 0 by one of the conventions that are used. So over here you see it is written i is greater than or equal to 0 where i is the level. So the convention that this uh, theorem is following is that, that the level of root is starting from 0. So root is at level 0. Now how many nodes are possible at this level of the tree? At the root level of the tree only maximum node possible is maximum node possible is 1. Correct? So, let me write a table. This is level and this is number of nodes. So, at level 0, maximum number of node possible is 1 because it will be the root node of the tree. Now, what is 1? 1 is nothing but 2 to the power 0. You see, this is 0, so 2 to the power 0. Now, one node can have maximum 2 children. One node can have maximum 2 children. So, if root is at level 0, the children of the root node the children of the root node, they are at level 1. And the maximum number of nodes possible at this level is 2. For a binary tree, is it is not possible to have more than 2 nodes at level 1. Correct? So, at level 1, binary tree can have maximum of 2 nodes. At level 1, binary tree can have maximum of 2 nodes. Now, if you see, 2 is nothing but 2 to the power 1. You see, this is 1, that is level 1. And number of nodes possible at level 1 is 2, that is 2 to the power 1. Now, let me show you one more level. After this level, after the level 1, this node 13 can have 2 children. And node 14 can have 2 children. So the maximum number of nodes possible at level 2. Maximum number of nodes possible at level 2 is 4. More than 4 nodes are not possible at level 2. More than 4 nodes are not possible at level 2 because 13 and 14, both nodes at level 1 can have maximum 2 children each. So, level 2 can have maximum of 4 nodes, not more than that. So, level 2 can have maximum of 4 nodes. And what is 4? That is 2 to the power 2. Right? So, that is what we need to prove using this theorem that at level i the maximum number of nodes possible is 2 to the power i and we are going to prove this theorem based on mathematical induction right now proof if i is equal to 0, we know there can only be one node that is the root of the node. We know there can be only 
one node that is root of the binary tree correct so therefore number of nodes at level 0 is 1 which is equals to 2 to the power 0 right so this is the statement that is true for i is equals to 0 so therefore the statement is true for i is equals to 0 clear now what is basically the process of mathematical induction those of you who have forgotten for mathematical induction you have to show that the statement is true for the base condition base condition means the most basic uh, condition for that the statement is true and then we will assume that the statement is true for an arbitrary case i so if the case is true for an arbitrary case i then we have to prove that it will be true for an case i plus 1 i will show you right now so we will assume that the statement is true for an arbitrary level i so let us assume that the statement is true for any arbitrary level i is equals to j correct so therefore number of nodes at jth level therefore number of nodes possible number of nodes at jth level is 2 to the power i no, sorry 2 to the power j sorry 2 to the power j according to the statement according to the statement for jth level the statement is 2 to the power j now now we have to prove the statement for j plus 1th level clear now at jth level we have maximum number of nodes that is 2 to the power j for j plus 1th level to have maximum number of nodes each node at jth level should have two children each right so the maximum number of nodes that the jth level has is 2 to the power j you see the maximum number of nodes over here if is 4 then for the next level to have the maximum number of nodes possible each node should have two children again i will tell you this is the maximum number of nodes 4 is the maximum number of nodes that is possible at level 2 now for level 3 to have the maximum number of nodes possible all the nodes at level 2 must have two children each that is the maximum number of children possible 
So for level 3 to have maximum number of children, all the nodes at level 2 must have two children each. So that is what we have written over here. That at jth level, the maximum number of nodes is 2 to the power j. So for j plus 1th level to have maximum number of nodes, each node at jth level, that is a previous level, should have two children each. Right? So therefore, total number of nodes at j plus 1th level is 2 to the power j into 2. Why? Because each node is going to have two children each. So if each node has two children each, total number of nodes is 2 to the power j into 2. Now what is 2 to the power j into 2? 2 to the power j into 2 is nothing but 2 to the power j plus 1. Right? So therefore you see, for j plus 1 at level, the maximum number of nodes possible is 2 to the power j plus 1. So therefore, from this we see that the statement is true for 0. Since it is true for 0, it will be true for 1. Since it is true for 1, it will be true for 2 correct so and since it is true for i any arbitrary level it is true for any i plus 1th level as well so therefore the whole statement is proved using the mathematical induction 